my devices here. Um, how are you? There we go. Live, why are you not showing me? There we are. Hello, hello. Oh. Whoa, <laughs> it's been a minute. I have been on summer holidays and our holidays officially ended yesterday. Um, so yesterday was a civic holiday uh, here in Ontario. I don't know if it was, yeah, I don't know <laughs> where all the holidays are. Um, but anyhow, I am barely announced, but woohoo, it's here. <laughs> I am so super excited that my uh, pre-order has arrived. So um, let's get started. Give me a moment. I am so out of, um... hello, Marina. I am so out of sorts with having to do all this stuff, um, get it all set up and all that, flip the camera around. <laughs> so <laughs> please um, be patient. Oh, and I didn't say, I am Marcy. I am Stampin' with Marcy. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator in southwestern Ontario, Canada. And why am I showing you my brand new products from this catalog? I cannot open it. I can show you the front. I can show you the back. But that's all I can show you. Um, these products, you can join my team right now and add whatever you want from this catalog as long as it fits into the allotted um, a limit. So what it is, is you pay $135 here in Canada. You choose $165 worth of products. You do not pay any shipping. In Ontario and a few other pro provinces, you don't pay um, tax either. So that is $165 worth of product. That's it. Um, there is no, um, you don't have to, there's no stress. You don't have to do what I do. You can be a happy discount shopper and just buy the products that you like. You can um, sell to your friends and family, whatever you want. It's totally up to you, but you would become part of my fabulous crafting community and you would get a minimum of 20% off on all of your products, as well as when Stampin' Up! has sales, you get your demonstrator discount on top of those sales. And right now, we have a 30% off of uh, kits going on for the month of August. So besides the 30% uh, up to 30% off of um, the online kits, you would also get your demonstrator discount. Woo! <laughs> so, all right, give me a moment to flip you around and move everything so that we can... Um, and I've got this twisted as well. My mount came with me. I wasn't sure if I was gonna have time to do record a video or anything um, while I was at the cottage and I did not. It was, so close your eyes. It was um, busy relaxing time for us, so. All right, I did not even get my paper pumpkin. I didn't do it. I still, it arrived literally right before we um, left. So I threw it in my bin and that is it. All right, so I'm just, there we go, bringing you down a little bit more. And I moved my office desk around. <laughs> I'm crazy. I know. Um, I'm going to blame it on my father because we moved. My father was in the military and we moved 
basically every five years. So I grew up having a different view all the time. So, all right, how are we doing? We are a little crooked. There we go. Okay, so it is a new month. We have a new host code. Please use this host code when shopping in my online store on orders under $200. If your order is $200 or greater, that's before tax and shipping. Don't use the code because you're gonna earn your own rewards. All right, so you look kind of fuzzy on, oh, there we go, we've cleared up. As I say, you look kind of fuzzy on my iPad, but on my television, you looked fine. All right, so let's move my lights just a bit. Okay, it looks good to me. So let's get started. So I cannot open this catalog. I can just show you the beautiful cover. So um, we're gonna start with my absolute, the very first thing that made it onto my um, list was bag of bones. So if you have followed me for a while, you know that Marcy loves Halloween. I love the cutesy, fun Halloween stuff. And when I saw this, now I did take it out of the uh, wrapper so that I could see easily and not have to all that crinkling for you. So this is a photo polymer stamp set. Oh my gosh, there's 23 stamps in here. So you can build your little skeleton however you want. We've got a uh, sunbonnet, we've got a beret and the little, uh, <laughs> the French, the little mustachio and the, um, what do you call that? Um, his bandana. Um, yeah, so super cute. Eat, shriek, shriek, and be scary. Boo to you. Bonjour. Uh, then we've got the cat and the dog. Um, skeletons, a bat, the bow tie. I mean, it's just so cute. It's just so cute. Like when I saw this, okay, like I said, it is photopolymer. So when I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, you are in my shopping cart as soon as I can get it. So the dies, look at these dies, you guys. So these dies, there are 31. So we have fun grass. We have this awesome fence. We have a headstone. Um, we have a mausoleum. We've got a little guitar. <laughs> We've got fun um, shoes, cowboy boots, uh, hearts. What else is on here? Bat, the moon and stars, just some loose bones. Oh my gosh, it's just so adorable. And as well as to cut out your skeletons. So another fun part of this, am I... All right, so another fun part of this suite is this fabulous glow-in-the-dark paper. So let's open it up to see how thick it is. Now, I did see a post. Somebody posted um, that they did take it into the bathroom and turned off the light. So it's, it's kind of textured. Um, that would be the glow in the dark stuff on it, right? So let me just grab this light and move you slightly there. I think that's better. So it's kind of textured. It's thick. It's just the one side. And then besides that, it's, like I love this set. Oh my gosh, I love this set. Look at these. These are glow in the dark bats and ghosts oh so cute <laughs> so here we have them adorable and you can tell they they almost look like pearlescent 
So that is, let me grab a piece of cardstock here. There we go. To kind of slide under so you can see them. So look at that. Do you see what I mean? About the color of them. Isn't that cool? At least I think it's super cool. Yeah, these are gonna be so much fun to create with. Oh, so adorable. All right, so let's put this back in. All right, so hello, Marina. Hello, Linda. It's a rainy afternoon and the Sioux Lookout and your internet is working. Yay. Well, uh, a rainy afternoon means that you can craft, you can read, you can nap. <laughs> Hello, Mary. You knew I would get this one? Oh, yes. Um, I do get so excited for Halloween. <laughs> I can't help it. I just really, I really, really love Halloween. <laughs> so, all right. So this is like that daisy um, paper that you can cut these down to be card fronts. Creep it real. So this is side A. And this would be like, so you would have, take your little guy and pop him on here. Like you wouldn't have to do too awful much with this, right? So you'd have your little skeleton there and then you could have a dog or a kitty or you could have both, the dog here, the kitty up here. The possibilities are endless. All right, so I didn't tell you the colors in this. See, I'm out of practice. So them bones and basic black, Cajun craze, pumpkin pie, and starry sky. So that is side A, and this is side B, and it says, boo, eek, The bee looks like, I thought it was upside down the way they have the bee. That's funny. <laughs> All right, and I am looking a little out of focus. Hello, Amy. No crafting, Linda says. The trailer was full enough. <laughs> Drinking tea on tap. All right, so that's A and B of that. And then, oh, isn't this cute? All right, and I am thinking, you guys, they've made it easy for us, I believe. So let's take one of these guys off. And, yep, that will die cut that. And there's our dog. That is going to die cut the dog. And then, of course, where's the kitty? Um, there's the kitty, the kitty cat. And that is going to die cut that. How fun is that? So cute. Thank you, Stampin' Up! All right, so now to get this back on here. This is not the way they were, but that's okay. All right, so that away yes of course halloween was the first thing i had to show you and then the other side so b and then headstones and mausoleums a and b oh that's so fun i love the colors and then <laughs> they're dancing our uh, skeletons here and oh look at that that is so cute now if you had a dog you could use this for a, a scrapbook page i have not scrapbooked in forever but the bones would be so fun for a um, scrapbook page for your poochie so a and b and then oh this is lovely a oh look at this with the bats so cute oh my gosh ricky d bones 
R.I.P. Jack O. Lantern, Tomb Street Sweet Tomb, and Creep It Real. Oh my gosh, so fun. And then we have our um, Starry Sky Stripe, and then the orange um, bats and the little moons. Super fun. So that is the um, bag of bones. Well, it's the Them Bones Suite is what it's called. So with a suite, you can purchase everything that they show um, with one code number to make it easy. So bag of bones. So I did get, where is it here? I had to get the other Halloween set. Come on. <laughs> so this is photopolymer, tricks and treats. And my phone is a second here. We're sliding. I must not have it tight enough up the, uh, here we go. All right. So we've got tricks and treats dies. Now this die set, I didn't even realize it had so much. I just noticed the treat box. So this die here is going to make a treat box for you. And, all right, so you would die cut two of these to create your treat box. And then we've got the Frankenstein hair <laughs> that you could um, die cut to give it a jagged edge if you wanted. So super cute. So two of these would make one fun treat box. And then we've also got dies for the house and for Frankenstein. And I, this would be a label. Um, this is, this is Count Dracula. And then we've got Frankenstein here. So cute. And then look at this boo. Oh my gosh. So fun. We've got this here. Any guesses? Do we have any guesses as to what this is? Amy just got back from the vet. Hello, Amy, with Aurora. How is Aurora's cold? Is it all better now? So this is candy corn. So you're going to die cut your orange, your yellow, and your white so that it, it would then be put together like so, how fun is that? Um, and then we have another tag, as well as I'm going to assume that that is um, to put, there's two of them, to put holes in your bags your treat bag, so you can do a little hole or you can do a bigger hole. And the treat bag, I mean, it's not just for Halloween. You can use a treat bag for anything, anything. And like, look at that ghost, it's so cute. So I had to get that fun tricks and we're just going to put that on and I'll fix it later tricks and treats so we've got some cute um bats and stars so adorable so adorable all right there's my Halloween stuff 
<laughs> the stuff that makes me super happy. All right, next, um, let's do my randoms. So this, I don't remember what this went with. Um, these two go together. This is the braided linen trim and it is in Calypso Coral. She's the picture of health back to her cloud of terror ways. Oh, 16 weeks needles today. Nice. All right, so that took a bit to, it's taken me a while to get into here. <laughs> Seriously, I don't want to snip that, but there we go. All right, so there is our braided trim. So, and then this, I think this goes with uh, another suite called Garden Walk. And I like to, the trim and the pearls. This is Blooming Pearls. So, look at how lovely they are. You know I like my gems. So, those two. But... You can mix and match with anything you want when it comes to products. This could look fun with the um, Halloween stuff as well. Okay, need to move this out of the way. I don't want to have a big collapse. All right, so then we have this large check ribbon. It is black and very vanilla so this is a little bigger than our gingham black and white gingham come on there we go oops come on come on come on there all right so this is wider than our black and white gingham let me just go around my desk and pick it up okay so so this is the new and this is the one we have in the annual catalog so you can see this is quarter inch and this is how wide are you three-eighths of an inch. So you'd be able to color this as well, and it's soft, just like just like this one. But I like it that it's a little bit wider. Okay, then my next, at this point in time, this is the only thing I got from this. I do want the um, some more products from this suite. This is Night of Navy and Gold. All right, where is the, oh, there it is. So it's sheer ribbon. Look at that sparkle. Oh my gosh, it is so gorgeous. So gorgeous. So it's going, it's got, it's slightly stiff, just slightly, not super, but Oh, I just love this ribbon. I love my sparkle. I love ribbon. Like, look at that. Oh. It's so pretty. Okay. Now, you can see my desk. The sparkle does come off. So I would not, I wouldn't send this to somebody who really doesn't like glitter and sparkle. <laughs> Unless you want to torment them. Okay, so this next uh, grouping, this is um, all about autumn. So, oh, this ribbon is just gorgeous. So I did not get the bundle. 
with the budget I have, I just, I choose, pick and choose my absolute favorites. And of course I have to get like the ribbons, but this paper, oh my gosh, it is gorgeous. So it is Cajun Craze, Copper Clay, Crushed Curry, Early Espresso, Moody Mauve, Mossy Meadow, Pretty Peacock, Pumpkin Pie, and Very Vanilla. So we've got A, so you get four, it's six by six, so four of each. Like what a gorgeous, gorgeous photo. And there is B. Oh, so pretty. A. And B. And looking at the catalog, you know, sometimes it doesn't always show very well. Look at that beautiful fall path scene. It's just gorgeous. I just want to go for a walk down it. <laughs> and B. Oh, I like this too. I'm liking all of these so far. I love wood grain paper. It is so great. Oh, and look at that. Very pretty. And then a overhead of the fall colors. And B. A. And B. Oh, isn't that different? Very pretty. <gasps> Look at the pumpkins. A and B. So the stamp set, the bundle, the stamp set and dies that go with this is, um, I don't remember the name of it, but it is Amy Kunder's uh, million dollar stamp set. So it's leaves uh, and uh, dies, but she um, was the one that, um, it's her million dollar stamp set that she helped create with the Stampin' Up um, designer. All right, so a bookshelf. Oh, that's upside down. And B. A. And B, these colors are just gorgeous together. A, and B. Oh, isn't that pretty? A, And B, you love the scenes, do you, Mary? It, yeah, I do too. They're just gorgeous. A, old books, and B. So that is the All About Autumn 6 by 6 designer series paper um, that goes with... I'm not sure what the stamp set is called. And then this ribbon that goes with is gorgeous. Look at how wide this is. So this is the Copper and Natural Ribbon Combo Pack. Now this is so soft. Oh, it's just lovely. You could create some lovely big bows with it. Oh yes. Handles for a treat bag. Um, if you make your own wreaths, a nice fall wreath. Like, look at that. Oh, it's, it's just so lovely. Like, look at that gorgeous bow. Wow. 
All right, and then we have the very shiny copper. And it is soft as well. So we'll make a quick and easy bow. Oh, this stuff is just gorgeous. And then I do love me a good embossing folder. So this goes with it as well, the Distressed Tile 3D Embossing Folder. So if I do this, you can see it better. Like, look at that. Oh, I love the Distressed Embossing Folders. Gorgeous. Okay. Move that to the side. All right. Then we have Christmas Tidings Embossing Folder. And how fun is this with... There we go. We've got... Um, love, cheer, stocking, tree, Christmas, Santa, Noel, lights, reindeer. We've got some holly. We've got some ornaments. Gingerbread man. A um, presents. Oh, it's just lovely. I just had to have it. So this is just a regular embossing folder. Whereas this one here is a 3D embossing folder. So, um, meaning you just put this through your normal um, embossing folder sandwich, whereas this one here, you have to use the specialty plate. Oh, I just, this is so fun. This is so fun. And using embossing folders makes your cards um, quick and easy sometimes. All right, Abundant Beauty Decorative Masks. I thought this was really fun. Now, we have let's put this like this. So we've got this pattern here. It looks like the bats from that paper. And look at this. We've got snowflakes. We've got fall um, leaves and acorns. Then we have, this is all builder. So we have the lovely sunflowers. And then we've got the centers for the sunflowers. Then We've got the bigger, this way, nope, this way. <laughs> is it just me, but does this not <laughs> look like, does this not look like um, bell, a balaclava, the, a ski mask? <laughs> At least it does to me. <laughs> Oh, I totally see that. It's, I, this is eyes and this is a mouth. Oh, cool. <laughs> I am crazy, I know. And then we have lovely leaves to go with it. So there you have that fabulous, oh my gosh, you get so much in it. And there's a notch. Um, and it's numbered, I'm just noticing that. So we go one... And then two, your leaves, like that. Then three, see we've got a notch and a number, and then four, to add that little bit more depth and detail to your sunflower. Isn't that fabulous? Oh my gosh, so if you, you may not have even noticed it, fellow demonstrators, and, um, customers when you go looking through the catalog make sure you pay attention to this because wowzers there's so much in it okay forget it i'm not going to try and fight with that <laughs> so all right then there was a couple i just had to have 
festive and fun. Uh, I just thought this was so cute. I love this set. It's adorable. So this is a cling set. Um, and I love to color, as you know. So looking forward to playing with this. So sincere. This is, I don't remember whose uh, million dollar set this is. Loved all the different sentiments, the mixed fonts. Um, I'm always um, up for a new good sentiment stamp set. All right. And then we've got, you may not have noticed this. This is when you get your catalog. This is a walk in the forest. And this is the making a difference um, product for this year for Stampin' Up. And in Canada, $4 from uh, the purchase of every package, $4 per pack, Stampin' Up is going to donate to um, different... Um, organizations that um, help to support those that are in need of um, some care and um, cheering up during the holiday season because as we know the holiday seasons can be very hard and difficult for some people so this is the um, heart of Stampin' Up! Um, their um, chosen product. So this is Balmy Blue, Cherry Cobbler, Garden Green, Old Olive, and Pe Pretty Peacock, and um, Pecan Pie. All right, so we've got oh, the bears, the bears, <laughs> and the fun trees. So that's A and B. Very cute. Very, very cute. Um... Oh, isn't that pretty? It does look like a balaclava. Yes, Amy. <laughs> but did you see it before I said it? Like as soon as I pulled that mask out, <laughs> I immediately saw that. <laughs> All right, so we've got this lovely, love the colors in it. A and B. Oh, isn't this pretty? A. Let me scooch down a bit. And B. Oh, isn't that pretty? Nice snowfall like. And A. Oh, look at that. Nice stripe. B. A. And B. I love them all. So far of the um, DSP or designer series paper um, that I've shown, there is not one pattern that I'm like, ew, I don't like that. I'm liking them all, which is really shocking because generally there'll be a couple that I'm like, yeah, but no, they're all fabulous. Ooh, love that. I mean, gonna be getting more. I can tell you right now. So that's gonna lead us into um, the next suite that I got because that bear looks like the very cute punch will. All right, so let's let's grab a piece of cardstock here. Do I have? I'm looking for a piece that I think that'll work. I'm going to punch out. There we go. So when you get a new punch, let's pull this back in. Can you see that um, darker area that I've be from just punching. That is oil that they put. See that? That is oil that they put on the punch um, after it's been manufactured when it's getting ready to be packaged to be shipped. So it is 
got that oil. So when I tell you that um, when you get a new punch, you have to punch, 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 so that you get rid of that oil, because you don't want that to be, to wreck your stamped or, I'm pretty sure I'm looking for the pattern. Here we go. Look at that. That punch will punch out that dude right there. So the ones, the bears that are looking to the left, that's going to punch out. Thank you, Stampin' Up, for giving us even more. Now, this is going to be, my September class is going to involve some of these products. I'm just moving stuff out of the way here. All right. So, because I literally just got this, so... I have to have time to play and create, but I knew that this was going to be, uh, some part of this is gonna be my September class. All right, so very cute. So this is photopolymer and uh, with the punch. Now you don't have to get the punch. You can easily fussy cut out that uh, bear, but oh my gosh, so cute. So we've got our mixed fonts. We've got a two-step stamping with our tree. Your bear can have a scarf and a toque on. So adorable. And then this is a sweet. So this, the sweet, when you enter that one number, you get all of this stuff. Isn't that fabulous? You don't have to enter all these different numbers. One number does it all. So we have this gorgeous, gorgeous ribbon. More sparkle, wow. It's like they asked me, Marcy, what do you want your ribbon to look like? And I'm like, sparkle please. <laughs> so this is um, sparkle ribbon in a balmy blue. And it is lovely. Now it's one-sided, uh, it's velvet. So you would just have to uh, twist when you go to, it's a little thick, but when you are going to create your bows, you're just going to, once it's keeping it loose, you can leave that like that if you want the center, but take that back piece, hold it and just twist it around and then tighten. And then give that a tug, give that a tug so that your tails are both the same way. All right, so the ribbon, then we've got these gorgeous adhesive back glitter sequins. Um, balmy blue. Uh, is that granny apple green and white? Oh, they're so pretty. All right. Then let's do the uh, paper. So this guy here looking to the left, he's gonna be um, able to be punched out with the punch or you can fussy cut. Look at this, the bear holding up the bunny to put the star on the tree. How adorable. All right, so we've got balmy blue crumb cake, crushed curry, flirty flamingo, lemon lolly. Oh, maybe those are lemon lolly. Um, misty moonlight. No, that's not lemon lolly. Lemon lolly is yellow. <laughs> <laughs> Misty Moonlight, Mossy Meadow, Night of Navy, Old Olive, Pecan Pie, Real Red, and Very Vanilla. So let's open this up and see. Let's just move that out of the way for the moment so that I can... Ugh. There we go. Oh, so fun. A and B. Looks like a Nordic sweater. 
<gasps> oh, look at it. It looks like a Coke commercial. It totally looks like the Coca-Cola commercial. This is going to be hard to cut. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> and B. A. <clears throat> and B. Oh my gosh, look at the forest animals. So adorable. So cute. The fox with the, uh, or the wolf, I don't know, is that a white fox or a wolf? I don't know, but holding the present, adorable. Deer with a uh, sweater on, so cute. All right, so A and B. Oh, this is fun, A and B. A and B. Oh, look at this with the, the footprints. So cute. So cute. Um, A and B. So much fun. So that, and then to go with that suite also, we have Berry Christmas Memories and More card pack. And this is what I think is gonna be in my class. Come on. This is so shrink wrapped, so tight that it's actually, there we go, curled the cards and these are not going to get back in there there we go so I'm really interested to see how they have packaged these up so we've got balmy blue crumb cake crushed curry daffodil delight flirty flamingo misty moonlight mossy meadow night of navy old olive pecan pie real red and very vanilla so Let's do the big ones first. So before it was, oh, look at that. Oh, this is going to be perfect for a class um, or if you're making lots of cards. So we've got six, one, two, three. There's six of these. And look at the backside. Oh, so cute. So six of each then, I'm going to say. So six of that one, then six of this. And then, oh, the back side of that. Very cute. And then, so there's three patterns, right? Yes, because then we've got stickers. Three patterns six of each which is so much better thank you stampin up having multiples is going to make it so much better to do projects and stuff with oh so cute and the cute little family of polar bears all right the coca-cola bear scene would be a great slim line yes all right, and then how many we've got? Okay, there's four sticker sheets, so two of each. And so this is the one. And then this is the other. So adorable. So cute. All right, so that's the big ones. And then how many are we six as well? Yes, we are. So six as well of the small ones. So there's A and B. So cute. A 
and B. Oh, these cards are so good. They are so good. So you can easily put your sentiments in. These are nice size sentiments. So let's grab just this one here. Come on. There we go. So let's back up the bus. All right. So your Christmas is better together type of thing. So that, see how that fills that area so nice. And then also here. Yeah, this is going to be so much fun, this, this uh, suite of products to play with. So A and B, may your Christmas be cozy. How cute. Now you can also easily fussy cut this out. Very cute. And then love the colors. This is like last year's. Was that last year, the um, Santa Express? These colors are a little more muted. I really like it. Let it snow. North Pole notes, how cute. Now, if you have the, um, the magnetic board that's in the um, kits collection online, you could easily do a Christmas board with this. Oh, this is lovely. And the last one. So this is so fabulous, these cards. I love them. So then we've got the um, cards and envelopes that go with it. And It is come on. There. All right, so we've got oh there's no oh, they're the same. So we've got two styles of envelopes. And Very Vanilla is a color I have not used in forever. I don't generally pull out Very Vanilla. So, oh, I like these cards and envelopes. They're very muted, so you can use them for anything. Like This would be great with the um, sweet um sweet ch sweetest ch sweetest cherries i was <laughs> i was looking at my stamp sets and trying to find the um the name of it so like see how that how quick and easy would that make your Christmas cards? And then let's, like this, pull that red. Like, fun, fun, fun. So cute. Love it. I love it. So this is going to be Watch for Details, my Canadian friends. Um, I will be having a class in September. Give me, I just need some time to play now that I've got my products. So, yes, time to figure it out. And remember, if you are not a demonstrator and have thought about um, giving it a try, you can add any of these products to your starter kit. All right, so oh, we got a lot of um, shine there. So this is Sparkling Snowflakes. I don't have a good snowflake stamp set. 
So I thought, ooh, I like these snowflakes. Now there is no dies for this. Um, there's the punch that would make a label with your um, snowflake at the top. But love the sentiments in here and the font. I love that. So this is photopolymer. Then we have, I didn't get, I really like this um, bundle, but I, um, my budget wouldn't allow it. <laughs> so my budget sadly would not allow, wouldn't it be lovely to be able to get everything from the catalog that you wanted? I sure think it would be. All right, we've got blueberry bushel, crushed curry, flirty flamingo, granny apple green, lemon lime twist, melon mambo, pool party, puppy parade, and shaded spruce. And this is such bright and fun paper. It caught my eye right off the bat. So A and B. And just because this is... Um, the one side is Christmas. This is not Christmas. The B side, you can use it for other things. So fun. A and B. Isn't that a great stripe? Wow. Oh, I love this. A and B. Oh, fa la la. Love that too. So cute. Oh, I like that stripe. Oh, with stars, B. A. Great, great paper. Oh my gosh, I just love it. And then a this is a great masculine pattern and b so fun so that is the merry bold and bright uh designer series paper and we're just about through my stuff i don't know if you guys noticed this my team members that are on here. This is the Deckled Circles Dies. Um, look at the size of this. There's 14 of them. Oh my gosh. And this one here, the biggest one, is five and three quarters inches. Like it is huge. That is so big. I was so excited when I saw it and I thought, ooh. Now that I have my own personal copy, I am going to be able to really scour through it. Um, I can't wait to like sit and go through this, but look at that, it just, Oh my gosh, so awesome to have that many circles and that big. So that is the deckled circle dies. All right, and then the last, does that all go together? What does that go with? Just a second here. Let me off camera here, look at that. Did I put that in the wrong spot? Um. Where are you embossing folders? There, page 23. Oh, yeah, so this here, sorry, this goes with the Bear Suite as well. This is the Snowflake Sky 3D embossing folder. So pretty, so this was part of that Bear, um, the berry, what are you called? 
gonna take me a while. Where's the stamp set? Very cute, very cute. So this goes with that bear as well. Very, very nice. So that's part of that suite. Okay. And then this is, I ordered three suites. Um, so I got the um, Them Bone suite. I got the Bear suite. And then the Magical Meadow. Now I have to call Stampin' Up! tomorrow because uh, Demonstrator Support is closed today. Um, my dies are missing. So I ordered the suite. So this is what came with this is comes with the suite. There's also dies that go with this. Um, I don't have the dies. They were not in my box. I lifted all the flaps. So these things happen, especially when it's really busy with, um, pre-order. So magical meadow. So this is going to be part of, um, I'm going to be having a uh, event, something in October. October 16th is my 10th stamp anniversary. I'll have, be celebrating 10 years as a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. So I'm gonna be doing something that um, it's going to be, for sure, it's gonna be on Saturday, October the 14th. Um, so this is a distinctive stamp set, um, meaning there's light patches and dark patches. Oh, and I'm sorry, Maisie's barking. The neighbor's out cutting their grass, but we're almost done. So hopefully she doesn't bark too long. There, close my door. So there are dies that go with this, so I can't show you them because they didn't come. So then we have these fabulous, um, faceted gems trio pack. So there we've got those. Oh, they're so pretty. These would be pretty flower centers as well. Um, yeah, so more to come about that. I will be doing special ordering specials, prizes, because I'm so excited for my 10th stamp anniversary, as I call it. So we've got this gorgeous ribbon as well. This is the silver and white sheer ribbon. It's half an inch. It is so pretty. And this paper, oh my gosh, you guys. This paper is so pretty. While I love, love, love my cutesy, whimsical stuff, I also really love the watercolor, soft looking stuff as well. So this is Winter Meadow designer paper and it's basic black, blueberry bushel, garden green, lost lagoon, misty moonlight, moody mauve, pebbled path, pretty peacock, shaded spruce and smoky slate let's move that out of there for a moment so let's look at this gorgeous paper so a so pretty and b let's move this out of the way so that we can scoot you all the way over here oh so pretty And then, oh, look at this. This is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, that is so beautiful. So beautiful. Okay, so A and B. Oh, that is just stunning. Oh my gosh. This would make great guide cards as well with just a sentiment on there. Very simple, subtle, oh, beautiful. As well as like a birthday card for a masculine. A and B. Yeah, this 
This suite just, oh, this paper is just so gorgeous. A and B, oh, so pretty. A and B, like, oh my gosh, it's just so gorgeous. All right, so Mary, the, your last order, the bundle, was short the dies. Yeah, I mean, it's a new system. They've got a new syst uh, system in the warehouse, so things happen. You just have to call Stampin' Up, um, and they will fix it right away. Same with customers. If you ever have a problem with your order, just call Stampin' Up, and they will make it right. They are so fabulous. That's why I just love the company. Um, look at this. Oh, that's so pretty. And B. Oh, it's just gorgeous. I just love it. Love it, love it, love it. All right. So then also with that suite comes this Snowflake Magic specialty paper. And... What is it? So it just says Lost Lagoon. Oh, we've got a couple crinkled corners, but that's all right. So it is one-sided. Um, so you don't have to go, oh, which side do I want to use? So let's see if we can't get it so that it's not. You can actually see the detail. There's even like the, the shadowy, the really muted. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. So A, or there's the one pattern. And then we've got, so there's six pieces of this. Oh, so gorgeous. And then this one here. Oh, it's... All right, are we focusing? Because of the, <laughs> because it's all shiny. So yeah. As soon as I do that, it, the camera goes all wonky. So I you can't get a great picture of that because it is so shiny. But oh my gosh, so pretty. What do you guys think? Did I show you something that um, you hadn't noticed? My demonstrator friends and customers, are you excited? If you live in Canada and do not have a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, sorry for the crinkling, that you currently work with, I would love the opportunity to earn your business and to, um, if you would like a catalog, uh, please reach out. I would be happy to send you a catalog. And since I have been away on holidays, none of my stuff is handy here. So um, reach out to me if you would like a catalog. I'd be very happy to send you a, a catalog in the mail. Um, you can be anywhere in Canada and be part of my team. You can be anywhere in Canada and take one of my classes. My classes are uh, both in-person and to-go options. So that is all for me today. Thank you so much for joining me. Uh, please share my video, Sharing is Caring, and it's how I reach more crafty friends, customer, customers, team members. All right, and I don't know where my... There it is. Don't forget about the um, kit sale that's going on right now, as well as um, Thursday is the last day to sign up for the August Paper Pumpkin Kit. Um, if you earned bonus days coupons, now is the time to redeem them. So you doesn't matter how many coupons you have, if you have five coupons, um, you are a very happy shopper in July, you can use all of those coupons on one order. 
you don't have to, um, as a lot of stores are like, only one coupon per purchase. No, no, that's not what Stampin' Up! does. It's, um, you can apply all of your coupons to the same order. Just make sure when you're entering your coupon codes, you put a space between um, the first and the second code if you're entering multiple codes. So, um, I think that is all. I don't see any questions. Um, I hope that um, I've got you excited, but don't forget, this does not start till September 6th, so we've got lots more days to be able to uh, focus on the annual catalog before we start focusing on the mini holiday catalog. So don't forget about that. Uh, please shop my online store. I truly do appreciate all of the support. Um, it makes me happy. This is my job and how I um, earn a small income. All right. Don't forget to click that subscribe button below as well as the notification bell. Give me a thumbs up and I will see you on Thursday. Have a great rest of your day. Bye for now.